<laughs> I have the Grammys on in the background. Can you hear? Can you hear that? Hey, shirtless. I mean, I don't want you to hear it. That's <laughs> that's the point. Hey, Joker. Oh, you can hear it. Okay, I'll just turn it down a little. That's fine. Let me know if you can still hear it. I turned it down. No, he's not streaming, Joker. He let me know on Twitter. Empty did. No, he's not. Sorry, you have to settle for me. I'm his backup plan. <laughs> yep, I am. Well, I'm going to go ahead and post the um, link to the walkthrough so that we can maybe make some progress so whoa that's not what I meant to do <laughs> joker I know I think he's busy he's a busy boy Oh, is that what he was going to stream? Was Night Trap? I don't even know what that is. Is that an, F an, uh, bleh, an FMV? I'm kind of tired, you guys. He's scared. So I'm going to have a beer, and that'll either help, or it'll put me to sleep. One of the two. Supposedly, maybe, probably. Hey, Ashes. Sorry it's so late, Ashes, where you are. I know, beer. Beer is good. I only have one left in my fridge, so I'm getting it. And that's it. So it'll either put me to sleep or it'll perk me up a bit. Hey, Noah. Thanks for coming by. I'm a little worried about the um, game right now because it looks a little pixelated. I mean, more pixelated than it actually looks. So I'm not sure. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna fall asleep in the middle of the forest. Uh. Yeah, I don't know. I just got tired all of a sudden. So, hey, Wax. Thanks for coming by. I don't think Empty's in here, but thanks for the retweet, Empty. Oh, that's okay, Noah. I'm glad you came by it, um, at all. That's nice of you. I am... Uh, use a fact for what? <laughs> yeah, 
You mean a wa the walkthrough for my game? You're so bossy, Joker. So anyway, um, when we laughed last, la when we last left, see, look how tired I am. I can barely speak. Yeah, we have this. See, shirtless is on top of it. That's all the mubot I could do shirtless. So you should enjoy it. I know, Joker. I'm just teasing. I was just being sassy. I get sassy when I'm cranky and tired. <laughs> You'll have to forgive me. This will be the Harper angry stream. <laughs> no, I'm not angry. I'm just tired. I'm a little tired. I had a busy night last night. I was, uh, you would not believe what I was doing last night. Um, me and uh, a, f a bunch of friends, we went to the St. Paul Winter Carnival um, here in Minnesota. And it was really, really cold. <laughs> it was really cold. And um, in fact, I had to wear snow pants. I actually had many layers on. I had um, long johns on. <laughs> That's my angry Harper gamer. <laughs> Thanks, Joker. I'll think about it. I'll put that one on the back burner and think about it for you. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. And so, um, yeah, so I had long johns on, I had jeans on, I had snow pants on, I had like wool socks on, and boots, and toe warmers in my boots, and oh, I had so many layers. I, we were just to the nines, decked out in snow clothes <laughs> at this winter carnival. And it was a beer, car it was like a, it was like a beer event. So you went and you got like a tiny glass and then you just went around to all the different um i had dollywood armor on that's right i wish i had dollywood armor i might have been warmer in dollywood armor um <clears throat> but anyways i we you would go around to all these vendors and fill up your little glass with different kinds of beer just to taste it was the tasting but it was so cold. I mean, it was like so cold. And the lines on the beer kegs and stuff that they had, their taps, were freezing. And in the glass, you would get a little bit. And within minutes, the beer in the glass would be slush. Like it would literally be like a beer slushy. And so the whole point of going is to taste beer well. There's other reasons for going, like just to get a little bit of, little bit tipsy. But the point is to drink beer. Oh no, it's okay, Noah. Thanks for stopping by. And Over's here. Hey, Over. How are you? But anyway, so the point is that you would be tasting beer. And we drank a lot of beer because you just are so you just are you want to stay in the huddle um, with all and the lines were really long and so it took a long time to get beer, and it was so cold. It was nice out like we went in the afternoon and so it was okay in the afternoon, but when the sun went down it was cold. It is my favorite place. Yes, it, I mean it, Joker. It isn't a. It wasn't even a mug. It was like these tiny like you got maybe like two to three ounces of beer at each vendor and so yes it froze like it was froze it would like freeze almost instantly it would turn to slush and if you had any head on it at all it would freeze and so <laughs> and so and then the as it, the sun went down it was cold it was really cold I and mean, we had a lot of fun it was super fun and then we went out to eat afterwards and stuff and we drank more there but um and warmed up but um and we got a hotel so we all hung out and it was really fun but just like I've, I had never been. I mean, I've gone to beer samplers before, um, but I had never been to this. So, no, you better not lick any poles. No, oh. that would be <laughs> that would be unfortunate if you licked a pole. Um, you could barely lick your glass. I mean, it was really. 
I mean, it was a, it was rough. So anyway, but the thing that I was like so impressed with, <laughs> shirtless. Oh dear. Um. <laughs> yeah, and. and Oh, you've only seen snow twice in your life, Joker? Wow. No, it's crazy cold here right now. And I don't mean to go on and on about the cold. I just wanted to share our little experience with you. But the thing that was so cool about this whole thing was, obviously, they want to warm people up. And it's all outside. It's on. It's actually on the Minnesota State Fairgrounds. That's where they do it. So it's a really big area. <laughs> Shirtless. You're fine. We'll have to have a conversation about that afterwards. Your sassy behavior in my chat. Um, but anyway, now you've distracted me. Um, anyway, so what they did in order to warm us up is they, well, they had like, they had like barrels around of fire, like at like hobo camp. And then they had like some fire pits and stuff. But I mean, you get one ring around that barrel and it's not emitting any more warmth. So that was kind of pointless. But what they did have were these, you know, like a hot air balloon basket. The hot air balloon basket, um, they would shoot fire, The you know, like to put up the hot air balloon, but there was no hot air balloon attached, to shoot fire up into the air. And they had three of those, and people were, like, huddled around. But it threw the heat f through, like, you could feel it from kind of far away. Like, you, you could be, you know, 10... 15, 20 people back, and you could still feel the heat. So, I mean, we were, were literally like a bunch of penguins around this, these um, hot air balloon, um, I don't know what they're called, like that thing that shoots the fire up in the air. But anyway, it was crazy that, like, we were all huddled around that trying to get warm. And, like, the whole point of the beer dabbler was lost on the fact that we were just freezing. And, I mean, I had mitten warmers in my hands and in my pockets, and... I, my thumbs were so cold by the end of the night. So anyway, but that's my story about our fun adventure last night. And um, I'm going to get started with the game. I think we've got a few people here. And um, yeah, fuel burners. Yeah, yes, that's exactly. I, is that what they're called, Joker? I didn't know what they were called, but yes. And they would shoot it up into the air, and then you could feel that heat. And they would just do it like for a few seconds. But it was enough to make you feel a little bit warmer. And, like, your face, like, our faces were so cold. But it was, like, minus 19 out. That's how cold it was. And so, and tomorrow night, tomorrow during the day, it's it's really windy here right now. But tomorrow it's supposed to be minus 45. I mean, it's been, it's just been record low cold. So, anyway, but, yeah, so I think it would be fun. I think it would be a lot more fun if it had been a little warmer. Like, had it been 10 degrees, um... Fahrenheit, it would have been it would have been a, a little bit warmer. So, Joker, where are you from? Like, where do you live? I think I know this actually, but say it anyway. I'm in charge. Say it anyway. Like, what do you mean by warm pads? We had like we have these like they're like little chemical packs, and they when you expose them to air, they warm up and they get really warm and they're and they work really well. But we did have those. But it only does so much. You live in Antarctica? Is that what that's supposed to say? I don't understand. Antarctica? I don't know. Is that, that must be South America? Oh, those are, that's what, yes, we, do, we did use those. We do use those. We had them in, I had them in my boots and I had them in my mittens. Oh, Argentina. Okay. Yeah, I knew that about you, Joker. Um, anyway, um, yeah, so it was really fun. It, had it been a little warmer, it would have been a lot more fun. But um, we drank enough, let's just say that, and um, maybe that's why I feel tired. Yeah, <laughs> it's in South America. Yeah. Thanks, Joker. I don't mean to pry on your private life. But anyway, so um, I think we'll get started here. Whoa, Sir Graham wants to run away already. I think we just got diamonds out of here. We have successfully defeated the tree boss, and um, we're going to move on. And hopefully, shirtless, you can help me. 
find out where I'm supposed to go because I know there's a few things that I need to collect still and then I guess the object is we need to find that key um, and we need to get I think a magic shield a magic mirror and something else that's magical but I can't think of what it is oh, okay Joker I'm just teasing you like I said I'm feeling a little cranky <laughs> Oh, cool, Oreo. I, I would love to play Starbound. I don't. I think it's on PC only, so um, so I won't be playing it anytime soon. But if they move it over to PS3 or or whatever, then I probably would play it. So so anyway, I'm gonna see where I'm at. I think I I think I kind of want to get back to the castle so that I can um, go from there because I think that's a good reference point. And by the way, um, shirtless, uh, I think at the very, I know, PC Master Race, Harper Master Race, that's what it should be. Um, I think at the very bottom of that walkthrough, there's some sort of map. I don't think, oops, I don't think it's a great map, but it might, it might work. Ah. Oh, good. See, I'm back at the castle. Perfect. Because I think I know where I need to go from here. There's a couple things I need to find in this area. I am an OP master race. I'm kind of afraid of what I was my laptop. But we'll see how it goes. So have you guys done anything fun this weekend? Anyone do anything fun? Yeah, see, this looks super grainy to me. Like, I don't remember it being that grainy the other day. But who knows? We'll see. Okay, so I think from here, I'm going to go east first. Yeah, it's my friend. Okay, so I'm going to get a carrot because I think I gave the carrot to somebody. What's Blackguard's Joker? Okay, I'm going to go north here. Ooh, a country album is up on the Grammys, guys. Let's see Jason Aldean win, because he's up, I think. Aha, see, I knew this is what I needed to find, this bowl here. Oh, I see, Joker. I hadn't heard of it before. But you like that? I like that. Okay, so... So 
So I was able to fill the bowl with stew because I have magic powers. And I need to bring this to the woodcutter and then he'll give me something that I need. You might be, am I, um, it's saying I'm dropping frames. No, I don't think it's a mic. I think it's my, um, okay. You think my plug's loose? Yeah, well, it's saying I'm dropping frames. I might restart. I might restart my whole computer. I haven't restarted it at all in it, like since yesterday. And sometimes that helps a lot. But it's saying I'm dropping frames. And and the um the graphics on the game are not great right now. So I'm going to save it. Hopefully you can hear me still. And um, I'm just going to shut it down, and I'll be right back. 